Hey guys, it's John, LeGrandzilla, and I have here a uh, super deformed kit of Baron from the uh, 1968 movie uh, Destroy All Monsters. It's part of a set of uh, kits that MDA Image put out of uh, all the monsters from that movie, Destroy All Monsters. And uh, this is one that I've had for a while and never built until recently. Uh, he's in flying mode, and uh, I have the Godzilla, the Anguirus, and the Baragon, and this one. These are the only ones I chose to get. And, uh, like I said, this is a super deformed style, chibi style. It's got pretty good detail for the size. He's a little bit smaller than the other uh, kits. But in the movie, um, I think the only Varen that they showed was his flying form. Um, and it was in the background because it was so much smaller than the suits. So it makes sense they'd make him a little smaller than the others. Because he's meant to be in the background. And so it gives a little force perspective. But yeah, this is, uh, this is Varen. Varen originally was in a... Um, Another movie, uh, w which was uh, like the first time Rodan showed up, was uh, was in the movie Rodan, and I think it was in uh, 1958 that Varen showed up in Varen the Unbelievable. He's uh, also called the Trifibian Monster, I think, sort of like. Um, what is that? Uh, Gapa. Yeah, Gapa was a trifibian monster. Varen is, in a sense, that it's like Gapa. He can fly, he can swim, and he can go on land. There's a little closer detail of him. He looks like a pretty happy guy right there. But I just wanted to show him to you. I um, tried to sell the kit before I build it. And uh, I ended up uh, deciding just to go ahead and build it because I'm building another Varen kit, which I'll show you later. Um, uh, that is Varen um, from Kaiju Freaks. It's not a super deform, it's actually um, a kit that is uh, a regular kit very good kit came with a base so anyway we'll see that next time but thanks for watching this one talk to you later bye